Hi, a HUD is a correlation of putting everything together to be able to produce the final numbers so we can give you your bottom line. It's a uh, two to three page settlement statement. The third page usually is just for the buyers. So the first and the second page are what really applies to you as a seller. And we always start on the back page because it's kind of an itemization of the fees. So we start in the 700 section where it talks about cost of sale and then it shows the buyer's earnest money in that block. We go down um, and you're not going to have anything into the 1100 section which is title fees and as a seller you're typically going to have a closing fee, a uh, document preparation fee and then wire fees or courier fees and recording service fees based on the number of mortgages you have. We'll go down to the 1200 section and we'll be recording. You will be paying state deed tax based on the sales price. In Ramsey and Hennepin County, it's $3.40 per thousand, and in um, the other counties, it's $3.30. So we'll collect any recording fees for any mortgages that we're going to have to satisfy, and that's a $46 recording fee per document. And we'll also charge a $5 conservation fee that goes into um, the DNR. The 1300 section is going to be just miscellaneous fees, such as a home warranty that, we, that you might have agreed to pay for the buyer on the purchase. And then we're going to total those fees on line 1400. And we bring them forward to the settlement statement onto line 502. From there, on line 502 in the 500 sections, we're going to add your mortgage payoff, any assessment balances that may be affecting the property or association dues, and any proration of taxes that you'll, that if you, um, owe the seller any or the buyer any money for the portion of the taxes. Mm -hmm. Up at the top though in the 400 sections then we give you a credit for the purchase price and anything that the buyer may owe you as a proration such as association dues or uh, proration of taxes. And then we'll just take those final numbers to show you what your cash to close or the cash that we will need for closing is. So the most important number though that people are probably looking at when they're looking at their HUD is how much are they netting from this and which line do they look at for that? They're going to look at line 603 and just pay attention because it will say cash to or from and it will have a check mark of what we will need or what you will be receiving. Okay, so it's very important that you see the check box if it's from or to you as the seller. Correct. Okay, well thanks so much Nicole, we appreciate it. Thank you. And thanks for listening and hope that your closing is a great success.